Okay. We're good. We'll ask you that. We're good. It's the Morning Brew, and we're going to put the brew in Morning Brew today with uh, the folks that own Zendo Coffee here in downtown Albuquerque. <laughs> with us today, Trevor Lucero and Pilar uh, Westell. Did I th get that right, Pilar? Yes. Welcome to both of you. Thank Good you. to have you Thank here. You. Thank you for having us. They're just down the street, Aaron. I know. How, how uh, have we not connected yeah. yet? <laughs> These will have to come down. Yeah. We yes. will. Uh, what does Zendo mean? Zendo means uh, a hall, a brightly lit, uncluttered hall for people to gather and have a peaceful moment of contemplation. And we like to serve coffee on top of all of that. Nice. So, Beautiful thought. And you make your own coffee. We make coffee all day long, starting at 7 a.m. And uh, yeah, we have really freshly roasted beans of the highest quality and grind them up, put a little hot water on it. And people are really happy with it so far. Yeah. So y'all are both from New Mexico? We are. Puro Nuevo Mexicanos. Oh. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I, I grew up in New Mexico, Pilar did also. Yep. We love New Mexico. Uh, plan to stay, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. uh, the, 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 I, we have some pictures of Zendo Coffee and I think you'll agree it's a very peaceful looking place. It's uh, very nice. Here's the uh, front entrance. You're on 2nd Street, where? In between Lead and Coal, right on the west Great side spot. of Second. Yeah. We're actually we're right across from Gertrude Zachary's famous castle structure. So, oh, so well, there's okay. a landmark. Yeah. So as you're sitting having a little <laughs> coffee, you get to look at this uh, really unique piece of architecture, and uh, so that's that's fun. That's nice for us. Yeah. Hey. You've, now, been, you go, you've been in the coffee business 20 years, right? I have. Uh, I, I ended up in the coffee houses as a teenager, and uh, I've been through many experiences, but uh, I've had coffee making in my lifestyle for 20 years, that's for certain. So then uh, what inspired you to create your own coffee shop? What inspired me, uh, I finished my educational track. I have a master's degree in painting and drawing, and, and the, the the faculty in that system said, go out into the community and try to do something interesting. So the main focus of our coffee shop is to exhibit local art. Mm. And so uh, the coffee and art have a really wonderful relationship. And so we're actually hoping people will come in, have a little coffee, look at some really high quality art. Mm -hmm. So Pilar, you have some uh, coffee on ice here. Yes, we, we have? brought you two of our specialty drinks, um, one of which is our famous iced coffee with our iced coffee cubes mm. and we really oh. like to I don't know if you want to give it a try you but mean they're frozen coffee cubes yeah too. Oh, wow. oh my goodness I'll we'll just give this a little shake really quick but we also like to add a little splash of coconut just as a mm. just for fun extra huh? and it's really oh that's a great really idea delicious. Try that I don't out? know if either of you want to try it by the way okay. on the issue of forgiveness it's a lot easier to forgive someone over a cup of coffee Larry right? it is so <laughs> I think that's good it, that's, a, that's how it all ties it's together. really good. It, yeah. So you've not only featured the drinks, and I think we've had a shot of the menu, but you, you feature the beans as well? We do. We have a local roaster here that provides us with our beans and uh, can order up pretty much anything for us. Um, and we the good have, news, yeah. Go the good news about that, this is a small local family-owned company, and uh, mm. they roast for us every couple of days, so it's really Beautiful. Uh, we need kind of a morning brew signature coffee you know yeah we have it right here for you it's called the zia latte <laughs> oh. Oh. i hope you'll try this okay one. i'm gonna try this this is tell me about this one now this is our finest espresso and uh, we add a little bit of white chocolate to it and it's a little mm. dash of cinnamon and this oh is actually that? it's magic it's like a sports drink really mm. wow <laughs> that's strong flavor. oh yeah smell that that's <laughs> so uh it's like breakfast in a, in a jar. Breakfast. <laughs> that, that you can drink and have on your desk or whatever all day. Yeah. All day. All day this long. is nice. Can I have some more? Absolutely. Please. <laughs> so the art in your shop, is yeah. that all local mm. as well? It is. Um, I, I, I'm in contact with lots of artists, hundreds if not thousands, right? The, New Mexico is a great place for artists. And yeah. so I, I, I know a lot of artists. We're hosting a new artist every month and uh, usually people who are pretty well established in the art community, but uh, we also take a risk on some unknown artists. Well, we love entrepreneurs on this show. We love 
entrepreneurs like you guys. That's and nice. This is uh, this is really special. We hope everybody comes to visit Zendo. The coffee uh, is delicious. Right across from the Gertrude Gertrude Zachary Castle yes. on Second yeah. Street. Great we don't view. mind plugging the Gertrude Zachary Castle. No, there's the antique shop too. You know. Really <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Just come on in and enjoy. Well, this thing. What's yeah. this called again? The Zia Latte. The Zia Latte. Have one of these. Yeah. Unbelievable. <laughs> well, I, I'm really happy to know both of you. We'll Likewise. drop by and see you. Wonderful. And thank you for coming on the morning. Thank you Groovy. for having us. Thank you so us. much.